everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is best friend tag. I'm with a best friend, Harriet. <laughs> I've wanted to do this video for ages, but Harriet's just couldn't be bothered to do it with too me. Too cool. Harriet's just too cool for YouTube. <laughs> yeah, so I've got the questions on my phone and we're just gonna answer them basically. So question okay. number one is how and when did we meet? I've known you since birth. Since birth, yeah. yeah. Uh, my first memory of you though, I was thinking about this the other day, my first memory of you was, it was at your old house. No. I've never no. moved. <laughs> <laughs> it was at your house before you had all the work done. Okay, okay, that makes sense. In your old version of your house. 2005, yeah. yeah. Okay. I think I must have been about six. Mm-hmm. And I just remember you being there. <laughs> I remember you just standing there. <laughs> But I remember you had really nice blonde hair, probably the similar length, quite straight, and I think you might have had a fringe. Probably. And I think before. you I think you might have been in like a green dress or something. And I remember looking at you and thinking, who's that? Just a great friend. And it was a great you. moment. How did we meet? Our parents are basically friends. Yeah. So I'm sort of stuck with that. Friends by association. <laughs> yeah, not by choice. <laughs> Next question is, what's your favourite memory together? Oh man, that's... I don't actually know though. No, I don't know. Because we played like... We play. <laughs> we played together all the time. We did. We used to play tennis. Yeah, I we used to play tennis. I used to play at your old house. I mean, I, I love your new house as well, but... I don't know what my favourite memory is. used to play in the garden. Remember? Yeah, we, we used to play in the garden. Trampolines! Yeah. Oh my gosh, we used to when we both got our trampolines. I would say... I love that. I would say that m my favourite memory was playing tennis. My favourite memory... <gasps> no! No! I've Take it all it. back! I've got it. Every single summer, we would be obsessed with buying a paddling pool. Oh my god! How have you not remembered this? Okay. So, okay. one time, we bought this like long slip and slide thing, didn't we? Yeah, well, the day that you nearly broke your leg. Yeah, is that nearly broke my favourite memory of Yeah, my that's childhood. what I'm thinking of. That's you know really... me so well. How old was I? 14? Grace, you're probably about 16. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, totally. It wasn't it's that 14. long ago. And um, we bought a slip and slide from Asda and we also bought this like whale paddling pool that was for like for four year olds, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. It was for children, this slip and slide, and we were clearly nearly adults. We were I was 10. Well, I'd, we'd slide on it but go so far that it would go on the grass, then you'd get like a burn, wouldn't you? Yeah. That like friction burn. I don't remember that. Oh, okay. I got that quite often. And, uh, and yeah, and then this one time I ran off the slip and slide and I sort of ran back on myself and I jumped in the paddling pool. But as I jumped, my ankle went over and I was like, ah! it's the moment my dad arrived to collect me. So oh, I just yeah. left off the bike. And I was, yeah, I was sobbing. Yeah. It was bad. Oh, it's good time. But that's one of my favorite, my favorite memories is tennis and yeah. summers with the paddling pools. Because we'd buy one every year, but it would pop, wouldn't it? So it would happen. I don't know, I think we just lost it all. Yeah. It was just, it was not great quality. <laughs> no, from Asda for my fan. Describe each other in one word. Oh, that's hard. Okay, you go first. Oh, I can't think of one word. My word for you would just be smart. I would say caring, because you do actually really care. Yeah, I do. About everybody and yeah. everything. Yeah, genuinely do. Yeah, I would say for Harriet, she's just smart, like <laughs> book smart. <laughs> I can. There's a bit of fluff. Ooh. <laughs> Naturally, <laughs> she's just with it. What's your dream job? Grace doesn't know. And what it's probably job what is. I'm doing now. Yeah. To be honest, in a realistic world, dream job. This is something that you've always been interested and always wanted to do. Yeah. So. You said that earlier, didn't you? I did say that. Earlier. It wasn't rehearsed. It wasn't rehearsed. No, I think my dream job in a realistic world is what I'm doing now. Yeah. But my dream job in a, if I could do anything, would be like, I'd want to be Beyonce. Like, okay. I'd want to be a performer. Mm -hmm. so your dream job would be? I would love to design sets for films. For films? Yeah. That's something I'd love to do, but I probably wouldn't be able to do. So, okay, so that's like your non-realistic thing in a way. <laughs> Other one. Probably be a lawyer. A lawyer. In a realistic world, should be a lawyer. I know, that's sad. It's not sad? It's a bit sad. It's a bit sad. Yeah. Okay, next question. What's your favourite makeup brand? We were semi talking oh, about man, this earlier, though, weren't we? Okay. Harriet's not really into beauty. She's only really into it because I push it upon her. Can you not tell? Can okay, you not tell? Natural my natural glow. My favourite makeup brand at the minute is Charlotte Tilbury. 
Yeah, you were raving about. Yeah, I was her. raving. I'm raving about Charlotte Tilbury. Yeah, Charlotte Tilbury would be my favourite brand at the moment, product wise and affordable wise. But for you, what would yours be? Because Harriet's like the other end of the spectrum to me, so it'd be interesting to know what you. Yeah, but you're sort of like the average girl with makeup, I would say. I have a benefit. Benefit. That's a good shout. Urban Decay. <laughs> um, oh, she loves Urban Decay. She's got more naked palettes than me. Next question, number six. Right, what is something that annoys you about the other person? I've got it straight I... away. I know what yours is, but you go first. Go on. No, you go no, first. No, no, you go I first. genuinely don't have anything, so give me some thinking time. The thing that annoys me about Harriet is the fact that she goes to uni really far away. <laughs> That's what annoys I'm sorry. me. It's That's like... what really gets on my nerves. That she, yeah, that she, you're really far away. <laughs> when you're home, me you're like 15 people. minutes away from me. Yeah. But otherwise, you're like hundreds and hundreds of the miles, miles away. away. Oh God, don't remind me. The thing that annoys me about Grace is that she lives. When I go to university. <laughs> that is a good shout. No, you've got to be pick a serious I one. genuinely can't think of one thing. Right, if you could go anywhere in the world together, where would it be and why? Me? Should I go to London with you? I feel that like would your be excitement so good. because that's like reasonable and like feasible. reasonable. Yeah. Because you love London so much. Because I know it's I would like to see you there. No. We but need then to if hit we're up like... Central. Yeah, okay. I'd like to go to New York around Christmas. I'd like to go to New York. Um, I would like to go to New York anyway around Christmas time. I would go to time. New York with you. But I haven't invited you yet. That's well, really awkward. To be fair, I would quite like to go somewhere like the Maldives. Okay. No, do you know what? That would be really nice. Like the Maldives where <laughs> like... No, there's no like... I don't know if there's Wi-Fi in the Maldives, but... <laughs> No, but somewhere where like there's not much going on on an island, but you're with we, you're with a friend. You're, yeah, do you know sure. what I mean? Yeah. Because with family, you can get sick of them because you're constantly around them. Mm -hmm. But with a friend, like with you, I think it would be different. Okay. Do you know what I mean? That'd be nice. Should okay. we book it up? The next one is a favourite inside joke. We have too many. Like I, we just have too many. I things. feel like it's one of those things with inside jokes when you can't remember where they came from. I can't even remember an inside remember. joke. Thing is, we have like an inside joke probably every single time we meet. Like there'll yeah, be something like there's new. new there's a new thing. Right, next question. <laughs> Who takes longer to get ready in the morning? Grace, it's you. <laughs> Why would you say that? Grace, it takes hours. No, it doesn't. That's such a lie. Grace yeah. would wake up early. I'd still be in bed and Grace would start getting ready. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's about right. But to be fair, I think for the amount of stuff I do to get ready, I'm yeah. not that long. No, I mean, in that sense, but compared to me, it's an age. Okay, favourite season? The time of the year. I know what a season Sorry. is. <laughs> season is a good time. Favourite season? <laughs> I'll give it a child. <laughs> is that season? That's <laughs> well, it could be. Okay, it could know. be. Yeah. Favourite season? I know what mine is. Oh, I think you... Mm. But for different reasons you'd like different things. Like winter you'd like for decorating things. Yeah. Autumn I think you'd like it for like clothes and like going for autumn or clothes. You know me so um, well. Summer I think you'd like it, I don't know, just whipping out some big sunglasses. Just whipping them out. Yeah. And then I don't know, I don't know your feelings about spring. My favourite probably season would have to be autumn. Okay. Just because like with autumn you can get away with different makeup that you wouldn't be able to wear any other time of the year. And the clothes, I just prefer autumn clothes. Yeah. And you've got the excitement of winter to come. Yeah, like, the excitement of thinking present is it like gonna family. No. What? Thinking like it's gonna be cold and right. I can like wear layer after layer after layer. Oh, I was thinking about family. Yeah. <laughs> I was just thinking about layers. <laughs> I was thinking about layering. <laughs> but I think oh, no autumn. Okay. Autumn would be my favourite time of the year. I, What's yours? I I do like autumn. For kind of the same reasons. Your favourite song? Oh, I don't know. Yours fluctuates. <laughs> Mine fluctuates. My favourite song at the minute, any Adele song, if I'm being honest. You're always an Adele fan, though. I love Adele. You can't not. I'm going to see Adele. Did you get a ticket? I got a ticket for Christmas. I don't have an all time favourite no, song. I don't it depends what time. mood I'm in. Yeah. I genuinely do. I have really 
different music taste? Okay, that's a great question. Uh, next one. Uh, what? Okay, so this is a bit of a strange one, but it's what is it like being best friends with someone who's obsessed with YouTube? I'm not obsessed with YouTube. She's obsessed. I'm not obsessed with YouTube. That's I just the want... first stage. I yeah, need to admit, admit it. it. Yeah. No, I'm not obsessed with Grace, YouTube. Grace, we used to come. I I'd come round to your house and you'd just show me videos on YouTube. We just sit. I'd come and we'd sit together. And we'd just watch YouTube videos, and then I'd go home. It was a lovely time. <laughs> I'll change the question. What is it like being friends with someone who watches YouTube and has a YouTube channel? That's a better question. What's it like being my friend? What is, I enjoy it. I, I don't know what to, I don't know how to answer. Because it's kind of you, like, it's yeah. the whole of you. <laughs> yes. Yeah. a really bad answer. No. But like I wouldn't know any differently. Because it's something that you've always been interested in and something you've always been like, yeah, you were saying about. earlier, Harriet was saying earlier that like when we were younger, just London, always making me do videos. Always do funny videos. And yeah, so is that your answer or do you want to give a better one? Or It's fabulous. It's fabulous, thank okay. you. And your answer, heels or flats? Well, your heels are yeah. flats. Yeah. I always try on your heels when I come in. Yeah, but I can't <laughs> fit into your flats. <laughs> Next question trousers or dresses? Well, it depends what for. Day to day, I'm quite a trouser. I prefer person. trousers to dresses. I like dresses that are like bodycon dresses. Okay. I don't like floaty things. Okay. Doesn't look good on. So trousers. Your trousers. Yeah, let's go for trousers. trousers. That yes. looks a bit bad. Yeah, that's it. Yes. Yeah. Uh, okay. Favorite animal? My dog. Okay. What's yours? I think I would say dog. My dog. Ah. Shout Next. out to Toby. <laughs> Shout out to Toby. Woo woo. <laughs> Your house was burning down and your entire family was sure to be okay, I'm including Toby in this, what would you save and why? Well you'd always go for photographs wouldn't you? Would you? <laughs> I would. Yeah. Because yeah. everything else you could replace but photographs. Yeah, go for photos if I can grab it. Mm -hmm. I'd go for like photos or something that's like really sentimental that you can't, like if someone's giving you something, yeah. for example. What's your example? I don't know. Right. Comedy, horror, or chick flick? Chick flick. Yeah, you. I knew you'd say that. I would say comedy. You'd go comedy. Next question: BlackBerry or iPhone? We say it on three. One, two, three. iPhone. iPhone. Favorite movie? Oh, no, I can't answer that. Mine would be any Harry Potter film. Okay. Any Lord of the Rings slash Hobbit film. Tyrion Teal. So I've already said about 20 films <laughs> with all of them but together. No, I like them because um, all of them don't in it. In a Harry Potter? No, I wish he was. That would make it so much better. What's yours? Favourite movie? I should be like, what some of my favourites? Like, Catch Me If You Can. Oh, that's a good film. Half. <laughs> oh no, I love the film, um, what's the one with... Uh... Terminal. Oh, with Tom Hanks? Yeah, I was thinking what's the one where he's in a terminal. It's <laughs> terminal. <laughs> yeah, it's a, that's a good film. Yeah. Like Tom Hanks. Yeah. And Tom Hanks and Leonardo DiCaprio. Forrest Gump, we gotta watch Forrest Gump. I got okay. shot in the butt talks. <laughs> is that for anything? <laughs> okay, what is something weird that you eat? Something weird that I'd eat? I really like popcorn <laughs> with... Oh, I don't like popcorn, so I suppose that is weird. Oh, with like melted minstrels because once you've melted the minstrels the shell of the minstrel is still like quite hard oh, because it's a shell yeah then you bite into it and it's all melted inside and if you oh. mix it in with popcorn no. the chocolate goes on the popcorn because you break a few of them oh god i want some right now it's really nice what would you say is weird that you eat <laughs> tomato ketchup with some things you probably yeah, no, I'm just, I have. Okay, so do you guys have anything matching? Makeup we must have, we have the naked palette. You bought me that ring once, which we have like a matching, um, you had a G and I had an H. Oh, yeah! Okay. Yeah, matching rings, personalised, she's got a H, I got a G. Okay, last question, what's your favourite TV show? Oh. At the moment, I love Impractical Jokers. Really? I love okay. Impractical Jokers. I also really like Sherlock and I can't wait. <gasps> Broadchurch! Epic. Broadchurch. Did you watch that Dr. Foster? I watched a bit of it. I watched all of it and I couldn't believe it was real. It I know it's not real. real. It's not real. 
I know it's not real, but I, I couldn't... You couldn't believe that it was not not real. No, I couldn't believe that it was written. Like... You thought it was real? No, some things that happened in it, I thought, but that would never happen. Oh, okay. Like when they're sitting at the table and she's like, you're a cheat! You just wouldn't do that. Gogglebox. Gogglebox is a good one. Gogglebox is funny. I have Gogglebox is good. TV shows. Um, we got Frasier box set for Christmas. Friends. Friends. Okay. Yeah, it's a classic. Graham Friends Norton. <laughs> Graham Norton. No, we've got to stop now, Harriet. We've got to stop. But but that's the last question. That is everything. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. A thumbs up for Harriet for being in my video because she's a little trooper and I basically forced her to sit down and do it with me. This was sprung uh, upon me. Yeah, it was. I had no choice. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe. Thanks, Harriet. And I will see you very soon in another video. Peace.